Fortunately, you know, we've, we've never let the music, the success, the, the highs and lows, we never let it affect our friendship. You know, we've always been brothers and have each other's backs. We all still have a good time together, so I think that's a testament to why, you know, we've, we've still been able to do it at the level that we do for 23 years. You know, we'll, we'll just keep pushing forward and uh, showing these new cats how to really do it. Kendrick Lamar is kicking up a lot of dust right now. I, I really like him. He's got a lot of crazy ass lyrics, you know. Like for for a West Coast MC, he's not stuck in that West Coast style. You can actually hear him flowing over East Coast beats. He's got that type of style. I think there's a good portion of fans that are disconnected from the history. You know, back in the day that never would have happened, but. Uh, these days, kids listen to a different style of, of rap music. It, it, at, at its root, it's hip hop, but you know a lot of this new stuff that these kids are listening to are are more. It's more rap, you know. It's more popish, and they don't connect with a guy like Slick Rick because these new cats ain't about anything that Slick Rick was about, you know. Dude, if he was in a arena where it was cats that knew the history and know what was up with Slick Rick, they'd be hailing the motherfucker, you know what I'm saying? If Slick Rick came on this stage tonight, people would shit themselves, you know what I'm saying? You know, people voted for that, man. The, the, the people spoke. And eventually, they're gonna have to get right because when all the other states do the same, and if the model works in Colorado, they're gonna have trouble keeping all these states that, that actually vote for it, that, keeping them, you know, <laughs> from going fucking crazy. Realistically, I think the model in, in Colorado will work, and I think the next state will be California and then a few other states will follow and then you'll see a lot more states with that same legislation with medical marijuana in place. Two people that surprised me were uh, Oliver Stone I was in a studio session with uh, with Damian Marley and uh, he was there for some reason and um, he was smoking with us. It tripped me out because I didn't know who he was at first and then I looked again and I said, fuck, that's Oliver Stone. And then uh, the other time I was in a club and uh, I was blazing with my homies and Mark Wahlberg came up and he says, hey, B, is it cool if one of my friends takes a hit? I'm like, sure. His friend was Bruce Willis. <laughs> so that was a trip, you know what I'm saying? Those are probably the two trippiest uh, times, you know, because it hit me out of left field with that, but yeah. Uh, Woody Harrelson. Every time he sees me, he hits me up for a joint, and I'm like, okay, and he goes, well, light it up. And it's pretty much like anywhere he says light it up, it's we light up, so it's one of those things. Yeah,